Namaste, my Phoenicians. Hi, it's Case. Welcome or welcome back to Frequency Phoenix 555 for your daily message or massages. Mm -hmm. My Phoenician, today um, the moon will be squaring Venus. A square talks about um, either growth or it could mean confusion in your life, but ultimately, ultimately, that confusion is supposed to point you towards strength. Mm -hmm. With the moon square in Venus, this may increase your need for affection. My single Phoenicians, be careful of wasting your energies, right? With the skull Douglas, it is ill advised. Don't you know, pink is up. Mm -hmm. If you are in a couple, um, you may be feeling clingy and needy mm -hmm. and may try to alleviate those feelings right with impulsive purchases pinkies up be on the lookout okay be careful with your energies today they may be misdirected and hit you in the wallet yes be a bit mm -hmm. the moon will also go on to sextile mercury a sextile is um it can be comfortable, feel comfortable, making you feel relaxed. You know, you wanting simple things. This is about, because the moon is going to be sextile in Mercury, Mercury is about intellect as well as communication. So you could find yourself listening more deeply to others' concerns and trying to help them sort it out. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> I'm not saying anything. All right. Um, also today, the sun is going to be in Aquarius. This may give you the feeling of wanting to reconnect with your past. Have a little tiptoe down memory lane, eh? Eh? Make sure that you're not going into that dark mud hut, the one that you left behind. Remember, it is just a place for reference material only, not where you bring your duvet and your pillow to rest. No, that is real edge-grabbing victimization of your own self. Don't do it, Scotty. Don't do it. Mm -hmm. Let's get the domino of the day. Well, that way, the domino is blank and a five. Yes, baby, the fool and the hierophant. Mm -hmm. Air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, as well as Uranus energy. I told you. Right. You're going to be listening deeply to others' concerns. But with the fool coming up, and we all know that the fool, um, the fool is ruled by Uranus, okay? This may... This... This may cause you to revolt or some, or cause a rebellion. Yes, baby. By trying to help someone sort out their own issues. Sometimes you've got to leave some people to sort it out themselves in order for them to get the lesson. You can lead a horse to water, but a pencil must be led. Pinky is up. Mm -hmm. The fall also brings to mind the energy of a new beginning. So I'm being spontaneous today. Mm hmm some people are going to actually be coming out because the fool can rep represent um, um, homosexual tendencies or a homosexual spirit. Somebody's going to be coming out in the public. Cop the eminent. Yes, baby. They're being led to take a leadership role in their life and move with what? Faith and trust. Yes, baby. 
Mm -hmm. The fool also speaks about travel. Some of you will be traveling today or are making travel plans. It also ushers in a new relationship. I told you we're getting some some of my Phoenicians, my prototypes will be getting true love's first kiss between now and spring. Mm -hmm. Look at their birth charts, right? Ask your spirit guides. Go to Father God. Ask Mother Isis. Don't just jump in, Scotty. Don't. Remember. Remember how tricky that high commander Decepticon was. Full of layers, like a Russian doll. Full of what? Shit patties. Yes, and everyone was more, more diabolical than the last. Mm -hmm. The energy of the five is the word security. Mm -hmm. Some of you may feel as though your foundation is threatened. This is why you're going to be traveling back down memory lane once the sun gets into Aquarius. Mm -hmm. If you've got any doubts about a situation, it's time for you to rectify those doubts now. Yes, baby, because a doubt is a red flag. Sometimes it's your solar plexus, it's your spirit guides, the only way they can get you because you're not fully open to them to receive direct mes messages. You'll get it in your solar plexus. If you're doubtful, like Thomas. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. The fool also speaks about dreams. A lot of you have been getting prophetic dreams of late. Mm -hmm. I've already given you a book that I've used for many years to decipher dreams. Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't even have the hardback of the book. It's on my um, on my phone and my tablet. If anybody wants to know what the name of that book is, I will show. I'm sure I did put it on the um community page. I can't remember. I think I did. If anybody remembers it, please put it in the comments. If not, I will take a picture of the book and put it in the community page again. I'm helpful like that. Yes, always out here with the intel. Mm -hmm. Five, the five brings the energy of um, the Hierophant as well as Temperance. Mm -hmm. This is about what? Balancing after conflict and loss. There's a true change coming towards you. Five brings the energy of change and rebuilding and only the way a phoenix can. From the ashes, baby. Mm -hmm. Pinkies up. Ooh. Very squeaky. It's not me. Let's call in the energies of guidance and protection. Energies up. Mm. Shadow side. A lot of you have been. I'm going to take this card. A lot of you have been working on your shadow side, receiving enlightenment, understanding the wounds, understanding how you was controlled by those wounds. Mm -hmm. Two cards, please. First card is the Watchtower of the East, don't you know? This, as I said, spring energy. And again, here we see it again, springtime. Mm -hmm. Air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is about you continuing to use your um, creativity. I also mentioned travel, be travel before, and some of you will be traveling to the East. Mm -hmm. Or towards the East, in an eastwardly direction. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. 
this is also telling me that you need to continue to use your innovative vision whatever you've been putting together in the kifa if there ever was a time to draw it down to Malkuf and put it to full action would be now Scotty mm -hmm. It's also with the mirror, it also brings, it's giving me an ominous look as well. Because I don't, somebody is using either mirror magic or looking at your pictures in a most, a most embittered way. Gosh, the kind of look on your pictures that make you feel like you need to take a bath and you're hundreds of miles away. Yes, baby, the full on Sputnik. Yeah, I'm seeing the tinge of green, envious, jealousy. And out and out bottom feededness. Yes, baby. Them ear to them ear to pictures. Baby. Do you know why they keep looking at it? If it upsets them so. But they do, they can't help it. Mm -hmm. Some of you are, are putting together your altars. Respecting your ancestors, those that went before, because you know that you've been chosen. Mm -hmm. This is about you applying your boundaries. A lot of you have taken your time to study. Study in a new way. Could be studying the unknown. Mm -hmm. Two candles, duality. This is about balance and harmony coming into your life. Because why? The cup is always highlighted. Self-love. And from this new beginning, that is this fresh start that you're be that is being gifted to you, my Phoenician. Right? Because of self-love. Your passions are being ignited and you've become a beacon. For your significant other. As I say and I always say, my Phoenician, always focus on what, what you want, not what you need. No. Be spontaneous, but not foolhardy. Mm. Yeah. Because this is about your security. We already had the keyword security at the top of the reed with the domino. This is about your foundation. Your security could also mean mental security. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Because those that want to speak to you and you're going to listen today deeply, they're going to try and beguile you into coming back or putting up with their shiz naive. They're coming through to what? Explain. They need to explain something. Listen, baby. Mm -mm. I don't know, mate. I don't know. I've got to do the Scooby-Doo. Wow, wow, wow. <clears throat> my first, my first idea is to do the what? Chinky Winky and run away and keep it moving. You're doing so well. Let the wicked do what they need to do. Isaiah 48, 22. And you know one thing that they're not doing? Getting any rest because there's no rest. And no sleep for the wicked. Those that wanted to treat you like what? Joseph's brothers. Do you remember in Joseph's Technicolor coat? Yes, baby. Sold him to the Egyptians. Yeah, these people. These dick-dealing, back-front, neck-stabbing fagans of the truth. Yeah, these certified ass-kickers that always would like to come through with a bout of what? Cognitive dissonance for you to keep you in other worth. Yes, lighting you up the Watuzi, making you do the Watuzi, because you was what? Confused in your cranium. Mm -hmm. Those same ones are going to bow down to you, the way Daniel's brothers and the king had to bow down, as in, as, not Daniel, why am I saying Daniel? Joseph, Joseph's dream. Mm -hmm. Somebody by the name of Daniel is causing an issue in somebody's life. Yeah, Daniel, Dan, Danica, Danisha. Or was it Dame to Kosiko? Oh, I did love that. Yes, baby. It's the same, especially when they did it with the steam fish and acro body. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I think I'll go with the original. 
with the base of the deck, we've got the Four of Cups. Somebody's seeing you as a big, fat, missed opportunity. An opportunity that you was discontent. Right? Disillusioned. By a dumbass. Yes, yeah, yeah, all of these came up. The Four of Cups is represented by um, Cancer as well as Moon Energy. Mm -hmm. Causing you retreat, to retreat and withdraw. Right? The first card we have out is the Five of Swords. Somebody wanting a one-upmanship on you. I command a Decepticon, a narcissist. I already said Daniel, and imagine that. This is what I always associate with this card. This person tried it. They tried it. They tried it. Yes, baby, but you washed your face like Daniel. It could have been a third-party situation, right? Helping to what? Cause confusion in your cranium or to hurt you in your heart chakra. But it's not... Well, we'll see that it's not working. But hold on a moment. The Five of Swords... The Five of Swords is represented by um, Aquarius as well as Venus energy. This person was a betrayal, betrayal, back front, neck stabber. Neck stabber, you know, not neck, neck stabber. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Plagiarize of the mind, verbally abusive, mentally and emotionally abusive. Good God. I'm telling you, physical abuse is bad. It is, I, I, listen. I've seen what's happened to some people. I know what happened to me, right? But you see the um, verbal abuse that gets into your psyche? Hmm. Hmm. That make you read some too. Yes, baby. Hmm. Hmm. As I was saying, somebody abused their power around you, right? It was always about self-interest. This was the, this was a full-on, right? Judas in a Peter suit. Mm -hmm. Somebody that you have to do the young Jeezy on and straight drop this and zip lock that. A professional sperm engineer, right? An advocate of the gingivitis. Yes, baby. Always coming around with that hot, hot talk. Mm -hmm. Please clarify the five of swords. Clarify the Five of Swords. Thank you. Yes, B.A.B., you saw it jump over them under judgment, B.A.B. Karma don't forget in the dress. No, it doesn't. It has a big file, and it's their turn to be what? Judged. This is also what? Looking at this. This same person. This one, right? With the, the, the knife tongue, the fork tongue. Yes, B.A.B., old lizard mouth themselves. Would love to do one more round, Julie. Mm -hmm. We already know that Mercury retrograde is picking up speed, right? We are in the we are in its hemisphere, in its ambience, right? They'd love to come back round, right, and have you stripped and naked and a and a bumbling idiot again, a bumbling idiot. Because mm -hmm. this is a Matt the knife that wants to return in your life. No, don't do it, Scotty. It's a simpleton. Of the spiritually short bus with their low down unscrupulous bottom feeding ways. Leave them on the bus. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. Two serious cards together. This high commander Decepticon Prakala Prakalisha is under judgment, not by you, but by a higher power. Because I told you, you are a chosen prototype. It's no mistake you are here at this time. And what they did to you, right, was meant, was meant to happen because it had to awaken you. You had to have that cut to the white meat. You had to. It was already contracted before you came here. And when you make a contract, right, when you yourself are in Kiefer at the feet of Father God Most High, you've got to stick to it. This is why some of these babies are aborting themselves at the final at the final stage. Because they've seen they've seen what they're gonna have to put up to with bottom feeders or or what an abuser as their parent. Mm. The jud judgment is represented by water and fire energy as well as Pluto energy. This is about your steps being divinely ordered. Some of you are being what? 
you was called to remove yourself from that situation and prohibited, right? And encouraged by the Most High to do the dipsy, la la po and chinky winky and run away. Yes, baby, towards the sun. The sun. The sun is represented by self, your ego. Yes, baby. Your whole persona. Your public persona. Mm hmm. You had to do a run for your life. Yes, baby. Sun energy is Leo energy. Mm hmm. It also, it's the sun also takes 30 days to transit through a planet. So I'm telling you, this meeting that you have coming towards you, one that is divinely guided, right? Archangel Michael, I'm hearing Gabriel as well. Yes, baby. You have a full team at your back. Mm. Yeah, they're under judgment. They might get it. They might go through heat. All right. And they're thinking, whom can I run to? Not the prototype. This is a Phoenician health warning. Listen, this person is going to be dedicated, right, to try and speak you back into certain she's naive that you shouldn't be getting into. We, I already told you this, right, because the moon is going to be sex style in Mercury. They're going to do, try and use their noggin to trick you again with intel that is of the what? Bottom feeling kind. Be Peter 5 8. I beseech you. Mm -hmm. Why is the judgment card here? Good golly gosh. All of that just to get the one card out. That flew onto the floor. We have the Knight of Swords. Listen, all of this air energy. Listen. This communication from this past person, you need to cut it off at the knees, baby. Mm -hmm. Right? The Knight of Swords is represented by air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. In the reverse, you know. Right? This person is open to, open to giving you more emotional struggles. <laughs> my fiducians, my prototypes, I can feel you snorting. I can feel feet shuffling. I can feel somebody shining off their back, so shoring up their perimeters, right? But they're gonna try it. Why? Because you're about to ascend to another level. This is why you are being guided, getting these spiritual downloads. Some of you are reminiscing about what you went through. Don't stay there too long, dear. That's also a ruse to keep you stuck, right? And victimizing your own cranium. Don't do it, right? Mm -hmm. With the Knight of Swords being in the reverse, this is the fastest moving knight in a deck. It in the reverse is telling you, Scotty, right? Respond and don't react. No, because you'll be dealing with what? The tactless and the rude, the left behind us. Some of them are criminal with some of the shiznai. They put you away. This person. Right, cannot maintain balance at this moment in time. And they will be coming towards you with nothing but lies and subterfuge. The real edge grabbing stuff, baby. That alone is making me want to use my palmers. Trying to dry up your life. Yes, no, don't allow it, Scotty. Mm -mm. Yes, baby. Welcome to your live video consultation, my Venusian. Mm -hmm. Telling you to beware. Oh, look at my cup. That looks like a teapot. Yes, baby, with a bomb in the middle. Mm -hmm. Moving towards the top. Somebody's coming through to spill some tea for you today, my Phoenician. Yes, baby. But look. It's a wolf in sheep's clothing. Can you see it? The sheep in the middle, and there's the wolf with the dark eyes on the out. Listen, you are going to be approached, right, by a Judas in a Peter suit, right? One that looks absolutely lovely, fabulous, and gorgeous, but they are rotten to the core, right? And they've got an ulterior motive why they're coming. Mm hmm. Yes, baby, look at that Sputnik eye. Can you see it? Where is my drop down and get your eagle on? Yeah. 
Can you see it? The eye? The all seeing eye? Your third eye? You better shine that bitch off. Mm -hmm. Shore it up. Because we ain't getting smoked. Eh, eh, eh. Eh, eh, eh. No, Scotty. No. We don't want it. We don't love it. Why is the Knight of Swords in reverse? Please clarify. Thank you. Yes, Beard. Look at this. All of this air energy. Listen, because you're thinking clearly now, right? You've got big shaboinking boundaries. This is also the sword, the hand of God in certain situations. What did it stop her? I was trying to put it down and it's like my hand wouldn't let me look. Somebody would like to come through, Scotty, and do a bit of self-sabotage. All of this air energy. Be on the alert. Use your cranium, my Phoenicians. Don't allow Bull Swanky to be fed to you, right? Because they will draw you in, right? With their lizard tongue, right? And it's all smoke and mirrors. Nine of swords this goes to. Good golly gosh. Mm -mm. That is... um. Gemini energy as well as Mars energy. Mm -hmm. This person is what? Feeling going to try in, try to aggressively, right? Put their power onto you. They're trying to get you into a, 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 position, a position where you'll be mentally trapped again and tied up in your cranium. Listen, buddy, bro, sistering. Listen, be Peter 5, 8, okay? The Nine of Swords, right, also represents... What? Malicious words, right? Because this spell word doesn't have to mean actual conjuring. It's the words that they've been putting out there into the atmosphere, attacking you with. But the sword of truth is coming through, right? Mm -hmm. Ace of Swords, represented by air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Keep your mental clarity, my Phoenicians. Wake up, sheer cop, right? Mm -hmm. You have a new intellect. Trust and believe. Where they left you is not where they're going to come back and find you. You'd be able to wrap your run ring of roses around them. You are so, so on a different level. They are so 2020, 2019, 2018. They want you to go back in time and be mentally trapped. But this person is being stopped in their tracks. Judgment is at their back. They'd love to rush to you and do all of these bad things. They are being prevented, spiritually prevented. But the, you know the Scott Douglas have a way of getting to you. Don't allow it. They're going to try and use subterfuge and bull swanky. And they've been putting out some things there in them screens that you're going to feel inclined to defend. You don't need to defend them. People continue to turn your back and keep it moving. Let them talk. That's all they've got. Smoke and mirrors. All of this sword's energy. Mmm. Divine is telling you, right, to use your logic when thinking about certain situations today. Don't allow yourself to be drawn in. Be unfeeling and critical if you must be. That person, why do they want, you saw this? Listen, they try to one-up the Empress. It doesn't work. You know your worth. This person can't do you. Listen, I told you. They're not going to come back and find you in the same position, Earth, right? And Venus energy. This talks about self-love. This is you. I'm pregnant with possibilities, birth, having birthed a new you. Yes, baby. A full-on new you. Mm -hmm. New ideas, new perspective. Understanding the grass grows greener under you, right? You, you two have been judged and you have not been found lacking, my solution. Divine has given you what? The energy of a fresh start and the creativity to pull it together, to boot. Yes, indeed you have. Mm -mm. Nasty bottom feeder. Plagiarize of the mind. Fagan, listen! Judgment for that devilish energy. Mm -hmm. Capricorn energy. This person is going to try and pull you back into some kind of bottom feeding way, either through argument or they're going to try and use their actions to bring you 
to, to draw some kind of communicate. You, this is someone that you are Easter Island Stevie Wonder on. Come on now, drop down and get your eagle on. Stop spinning in confusion, my Phoenicians. Right? Look here. There's F shit here. This person is going to try to make you um, anxious. Some form of action, right? To get some kind of reaction underneath you. Because this person loves the narcissistic supply. You don't know what that is? Listen, drop down and get your eagle on. Google is your friend. You need to research them like the animals in the wild that they are. This person would love to draw you back into a, what, a negative cycle. Mm -hmm. If they can get a word in, they feel as though they can slide back into your bed. Good God. Your tomb of rest, I think, not Scotty. Stop them in their tracks because you know who you are. You are not in other worth anymore. This is the judgment for you to know who you are when this negative energy tries to come back to you, to put you back, to bind you in those chains. Those chains of codependence and neediness and out-and-out bottom-feeding behaviours. Mm -hmm. Yes, baby. What did I say? You've got them on block, dear. You listen, the NFL need to get you on that team. You've got competition around you, but you are in a better position. Remember what they did. Have the memory of an elephant, right? Divine is calling you today to respond and not react, right? Mm -hmm. Be like Buddha. Mm -hmm. Whomsoever you've blocked, social media from your mind, from your life, keep them on block. They haven't changed. If anything, they've, they've um. They have accomplished their nefarious ways. They fine-tuned it. But don't worry. Look, the devil under judgment. They might go get it. They're going to get it. Continue to block them. Block your energy from these people. Don't let them ear hustle you into listening. No. Homosexual. A whole bracola. Or bracolisha. Right? When you left that situation, you left with two different shoes. That goes to show the amount of confusion that was on your cranium. Right? But, my Phoenician, the Seven of Wands is Leo energy. Mm -hmm. And we, as we all know, Leo is the what? The fifth house. This is about your self-expression, your spirit. They, they blocked off your childlike spirit, your um, lack of Lack of joy of what's going to come next because all that came from them was mental torment and torture, right? Being bound, you drinking and smoking, doing all, all sorts of bad things to yourself because of what? How they did you in your cranium. It's time to keep it cut off, right? Divine is telling you to trust. Know where your loyalty must be lied. Mm -hmm. Not be lied. I mean, where you lie your loyalty down. Because the fool is about you being spontaneous. But not a damn fool. Don't be stupid. C-H-E-W-P-I-D. No. That situation is dead in the water. But I said they're going to try and send peccadillas your way. Mm -hmm. Continue to block that negative energy because you are a rose amongst thorns. Clarify the um, Eight of Swords and the Ace of Swords. Baby! Broke pocket tools! Buddy, have you got a dime? Yes, baby. This person wants to keep you tied up and trapped in your cranium because they realize that what? Minna, invest on that again. This person, this, this, this Chiquita, right? This Prakala, High Commander Decepticon, right? Is not loyal. And they're abusive, extremely abusive and conceited, right? They feel as though they've got what? All the keys to the kingdom. The only key them have, right, is to get back on that spiritual short bus. They've got the key to start the engine. Yes, baby. And they'd love to come and pick you up and draw you up in their maelstrom today. Don't listen to what they've got to say, right? Because all they're going to do is try and trap you mentally, right, in your cranium. But you know the truth, Ruth. Read between the lines. What do you have to gain from this person being back in your life? Right? This is also telling me judgment is going to be brought down on a work situation. Mm -hmm. 
where there's been a lack of communication on your part. A lot of them are, are abusing you behind your back. A lot of nasty things are being said. But divine is telling you to block that energy out, right? Because you have a master plan. If you haven't formulated it, it's on its way. And that is to cut out the bull swanky. This is about you exiting stage left from a situation that you're stagnant in that's full of bureaucracy, right? Whilst they talk about you behind your back. But judgment would be, you will get the last what? Blow off that trumpet with the judgment, right? You're not going to invest in that situation anymore. Divine is giving you something else. Mm -hmm. Seven of Pentacle and the King of Pentacle in the reverse. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. This is talking about a change in your stability. This is about you moving on to a different situation. Earth and fire energy, my pollution. Mm -hmm. Don't stay stuck in that situation because um, of fear and anxiety. It will keep you bankrupt, bankrupt right? Of the soul. Yes, baby, and you don't like that because you will be pulled straight back into the what? T. And yes, I don't even want to say it. I feel like I need to look over my shoulder. Yes, BRB. Nobody don't want that. We don't want that smoke. No. Mm -mm. Block yourself from those people that dare to treat, dare, right? To beguile you off your flip flop only to treat you like a cum bucket. These words I like to stick in your mind when you think about them. Yes, BRB. Mm -hmm. I need Kipper on this to clarify these cards. Kipper, what of this five of swords, this bottom feeder, right? They're getting unexpected income about you and your glow up. Yes, be a bit. Two and seven goes to a nine. What the nine brings into mind? The hermit. Right? Research. I told you. They've been doing recon on you the whole time. All those what? Wanderings up and down your spine. It's them! It's them! It's Sputnik! Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. They've had an idea about you and your boss up -edness. I told you. They've been watching your everything. Right? And they feel that they've been unfairly judged in a situation. But they don't know how to approach you. Listen. We've already said... Anybody from the past, anybody from the past, hear ye, hear ye, and hear ye good. If you need to reapproach the thronehood of the prototype, whether they are male or female, please approach with your head on a platter and you carrying it. If you can do that, it would be wonderful. It would be absolutely awesome and lovely. Come back with your head on a platter separated from said body because we're not having it right about the empress what do they know about the empress look great fortune is shining down on you and they are jelly bogelly i told you they are spying you they are watching with the children of the corn i look at that green face in the background scotty look at it smokation indicated they're watching your great fortune Two and six goes to an eight. That's the number of karma, right? Consequences. The scales being balanced out in your favor, right next to the judgment. And this what? Nefarious energy, right? This what? Trauma bond. This soul tie that you've had to what? Cut away on a spiritual level. Because once is about spirituality. This is about you jumping into that spiritual bath. Reading Psalms 91, Psalms 23, Psalms 121 on a daily basis. This is about you continuing to what? Zip up your spiritual armor. Mm -hmm. The shield of faith, the belt of truth, the sword of the spirit, right? The breastplate of the righteous. Right? Your helmet, your cranium, right, is covered with salvation and your foot is shot in the gospel. Bottom feeder. Mm. Look, continue to block them out. Block all communication, right? For they are Sputnik and they are legion with their nefarious words and ways. And they want to use you like a cum bucket. Are you a cum bucket? These questions we need to ask. And if you are, hit me up in the comments. We need your brothers and your sisters, fellow prototype, need to straighten you out. Not in a bad way, but you need to be spoken to because your cranium needs to be sorted out. Stat! Mm -hmm. 
They want to come through the Jezebel spirit. All right. Watch out this judgment. Kipper. We are eagle. Eager. Eagle, I said. I'm going to leave that where it fell. All right. Watch out this judgment. Thank you. Yes, baby. There aren't you always on their mind. Yes, baby. Mm -hmm. They're never going to forget you. Right? They're also going to remember what they did to you. Mm -hmm. Some of them are going to try and write a message to you. They're going to try and send a message in a bottle. Imagine that. Mm -hmm. Seen all of the chakras. All of their chakras are unbalanced. These brushes are upside him down. Yes, baby. What is that in the background? I've never... Sometimes... The subconscious draws you in to look a little deeper. It's a case and the, lock, the latch is off. Do you know, it's like a shape of a magnifying glass, something that you put over a map to enlarge in certain parts of the map. Yes, be a bit. Divine is telling you to drop down and get your eagle on, buddy. Mm -hmm. They've been putting their thoughts on you. Yes, be a bit. Listen, Ephesians 6.13, shore up your shiznai. Mm -hmm. What about this devil energy, Kippa? We are eager to know. Don't even want to come out. Yes, baby, some of you could have been in a marriage with this person. What else? Right? Not anymore, buddy. No. Changes are afoot. And you are always on their mind. Big changes, big fortunate changes. Because why? You are the big cat. Big cat prototype, yes, baby. You changed your face in this world and continue to block out a situation that is full of stagnancy, right? Somebody who is always quick to come in with the gaslighting and plagiarize your mind up the watuzi, right? Look, on the blockation, the coffin, you ended that situation. You already sang Amazing Grace and Shall We Gamble by the River? Not, not for this person, no. Mm -hmm. This is also you. This is a male in a work situation. It could be your manager, right? Thinking about you, right? But not. Do you see this person putting any pen to paper to help out any situations? No! And they're thinking nasty things as well. Sly old fox. Mm -hmm. Dropped in the reverse. They're thinking bad things about you, babe, but don't worry about it. That work situation is all going to be locked, signed, sealed, delivered, right? With a number of asses being put in a sling. Worry not, my Phoenician, whom God bless. No man can curse. I What's Isaiah 54, 17? No weapon formed against you, my Phoenician, shall prosper. Right? Don't allow yourself to be tied up in the cranium. Because you can free your mind, right? That's ruminating thoughts about a situation in a work working field or a previous love situation. But this is all swords. I've not, I've never, not seen nary a one cup, right? This person, right, didn't never loved you. They never loved you. You was the original victim of hate from the gate. Cough into that and bury those thoughts as well. Bury those thoughts. I'm not saying bury the emotion because you have to feel the pain in order to come through the pain. Feel the emotion and put it to the back. Reference material only. Knight of Swords in the reverse. Kipper, come through. What does it mean? That's a lot of cards. Unsa Ewa. Unsa Ewa. Did you dirty? They my got your eat. And they are crying like a babes in arms. Yes, cry like a bitch you must. Mm -hmm. Luke 22, 62. They feel in the length and breadth of that. Mm -hmm. Despairing over the loyalty that they didn't give you. Look at the even fighter don't even want to look them in the eye. And they may have lost their job or had to step down a peg or two. Yes, baby, they're being taught manners like a child by the universe, right next to the judgment of all those nasty faults in their mind, blaming you for their situation. Mm -hmm. Cough into that, deaf to that. 
because that person who looked at that red rag tied around their throat chakra, they knew what was going on. The lion liar, lizard tongue, ginger vitus smell. Mm-hmm. What of this ace? Look, didn't I just tell you? This is the God card, no higher honor card. I told you the sword is light. There's the hand of God in your life, my Phoenician, cutting through that mile right that mental mile because it's keeping you stagnant and stuck and trapped mentally in a situation that you are no longer a victim of you are not a um no longer a survivor you are a thriver right and you need to be that example for others mm -hmm. because there's other people on the field that need to be sorted out divine is putting in its hand on your back being the wind beneath your wings Giving you the ammunition to deal with all what needs to be dealt with. You are stronger than you than you even believe. Right? Look what fell on the rock pocketers, buddy. Have you got a dime? Them are no pentacle. No pentacle. None. Not a bean. Everything they did to you is affecting their health. Their health. Their stability. Who can I run to? Not me, not you. They can't trust anybody around them. And this is what fell on them. Mentally entrapped. Some of them are going to prison. Yes, baby, they made a bad investment. Mm -hmm. Or oh, they was a bad investment. They what? In the fairest ways of being unmasked. And to prison you must go with the prisoners. Right. Divine is continue telling you to continue to turn your back on that melee. Right. Leave them where, where they will be imprisoned with rat things because what they are, the pipe piper of the bottom feeding kind. Yes, baby. Leave them where they are with their rat, watching their every move. Mm -hmm. Because you are wise. You have the whole world be, be, before you, my Phoenician. Five talks about change. This is a chance for your new life. Judgment has been called. And it will be a story of success for you, my solutions. You saw all that unexpected in income, that great fortune, right? Leave that marriage right to the devil in the past, whether it was a friendship, um, a work situation, leave it behind because those that were directing all of that dark energy towards you as is being returned to sender by what? Michael and Gabriel. Mm -hmm. Continue to use your higher learning, your higher knowledge, because this is the hand of God in your life, my solution. Allow the quiet space in your mind for these true downloads from Father God Most High, right? To bring you out of this entrapment and entanglement of the cranium. Let's get an FP on this and then I'm out of here for show. They was dedicated. I cause new ball swanky, but divine is saying what? I'm even more than you, my Phoenician. I'm even more dedicated than them. Because you was at rock bottom and there was nowhere else to go but up. Right? Leave Wombs Ever is in been sent to Coventry where you send bottom feeders, right? On a spiritual short bus. Leave them there, right? Because, listen, Dharma in the reverse is karma. They might, I told you, judgment has been called in their situation. And it's doing a diabolical thing for them, right? This person, right, didn't know your worth. They didn't know what they had. They let the prototype slip through their fingers. Because you was got, you have a guardian at your back. I'm getting a young female, somebody who didn't reach maturity. An untimely death. It's a young female that's passed. This is the one that's giving the most help. Giving you the chance to live a life less ordinary, my Phoenician. On that note, I dropped me mic. Todd Lovey to Teesprings where I have a plethora of paraphernalia that will surely titillate your fancy. Or become a member on this channel where the members get a chance to choose the direction of the read on a Thursday. Why Thursday? It's Jupiter Thursday for truth, expansion and the Phoenician way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you're
require a personal reading from me, please contact me at frequencyphoenix555 at gmail.com. Thank you very much for your continued support of me and for my Phoenicians. We are fast approaching a million views on this channel. One million views. Mm. Thank you. And as I always say, from the ashes, baby, don't get smoked. Three go-to moves. Namaste.